Hello everyone, in this video I'll be reviewing this smartphone by Samsung um, It's the S20 Plus model and it's the 5G version This is one of the best um, smartphones you can get these days um, Quite expensive but has a lot of features built in And I'm going to go through what kind of features he has I've also um, recorded a video and uh, I took uh, one or two pictures as well just, just to show you the quality of the camera um, These days most smartphones that comes out it's all about the camera so Samsung camera is one of the best ones these days um, Especially trying out the S10 Plus that had an excellent um, video camera uh, Photos etc um, The stability was brilliant S20 Plus should be even better Now let's start with the display Now this display as you can see compared to the S10 Plus this one is not curved in, like usually the S10 Plus was more um, curved in, um, out on both sides, okay, whereas this one is more straight, okay. So that's something I like about the S20 Plus. And it has a built in dynamic AMOLED screen as well. Uh, the touch screen is perfect, it's very smooth and responsive, easy to use, and very smooth as well. It has a built in 6.7 inch um, screen, as you can see here. Um, with a 1440 times 3200 pixels um, and it has a Corning Gorilla Glass 6 built in as well to give you the extra protection on the screen you can also put your own um, temperate screen protector for extra protection just to, f just to show you what else it comes with it comes with uh, a mains plug which is both sides is a USB Type-C so one side is not standard USB it's both sides are USB um, USB Type-C it also comes with a uh, um, AKG um, wired earphones and the bottom bit is micro um, USB Type-C as well um, because this uh, phone doesn't take a 3.5mm headphone jack it also comes with spare earbuds in different sizes and it also comes with an adapter that you can um, change from micro USB to USB type C okay so it, it also has a built-in Android 10, po um, 10 built in to this and the chipset is Exynos 990 it has a built-in uh, 128 gig internal memory and 8 gig RAM so you can play a lot of games and um, do as many as much of um, whatever you want to do on your smartphone or you won't slow it or slow down your smartphone on top of that, the camera. Now the camera, the uh, rear camera, it has a 12 megapixel wide angle camera. It also comes with a, a 64 megapixel telephoto camera, a 3 times hybrid optical zoom camera, and a 12 megapixel ultra wide camera, which uh, that provides a super steady video and the stability as well. And it also comes with a 0.3 megapixel depth camera as well. It also com comes with a um, LED flash that's quite powerful as well. Um, especially when it's close, close up, you can see the quality uh, when it's recording with the um, LED flash on. And it also has an auto HDR panorama built in. Okay, so this and um, the video um, can be um, recorded up to 4320p at 24fps. Um, it also has a dual video recording built in. Stereo sound, gyro, EIS and IO, um, OIS as well. The selfie camera at the front uh, has it. Um, it only has one camera, by the way. So, like this 10 Plus, it had two. Um, this one only has one. Uh, so, there, it might be the um, this S20 Ultra that has that two camera at the front. Now, the front camera has a dual uh, video calling as well and auto HDR built in. You can do the video recording with the selfie at the front with 2160p at 30 or 60 fps. Or you can change it to 1080p at 30fps. Also, it has a stereo speaker built in at the bottom here, um, that ha is tuned by AKG. Um, also, the charging port is at the bottom as well. So the USB charge um, Type C is at the bottom. On the right side, that's the power button and the volume button. At the top, you require a pin to put the SIM in here. Alright, so if that can zoom in here, here, and on the left side there's nothing there, Just and the camera is at the back here. It's a very simple phone, slim phone as well, On and like other, other kind of features, for example, it has the ultrasonics under display fingerprint sensor, which is a lot responsive, and it, you know, it will unlock it with the first touch without having to repeat it to unlock it. 
It has Bluetooth 5.0, GPS, NFC, USB-C, etc. built-in. It also has a built-in 4,500 mAh battery capacity. And it also has a built-in fa fast charge of 25 watts. If you're using a fast key or PMA um, wireless um, charging um, dock, etc. It can, it can be charged up to 15 watts. Okay, so that's all the features that it has built in. Now, let me go to the um, the gallery, and I can show you the videos um, that I've done.